All right, YouTube land, we're back with another video. Today we have a brand new out of the box Connex 4600, six 4600s uh, that uh, we're building for Paul. All right, Paul, we've got it hooked up here for the initial checkup. Um, she don't look too bad. She's got a few spikes here and there. I've seen a lot worse. So uh, we haven't even converted it over pretty close to on frequency so all right we're gonna get into this thing so we're gonna go ahead and uh, pause the video get her opened up do the conversion and do the initial checkup and uh, we'll be back okay we're back with the Connex 4600 uh, turbo for uh, Paul Paul we got it uh, converted over and uh, it's pretty close to being on we're gonna bring it up that uh, couple of one thousandths there and make it dead nuts on uh was just inspecting the radio everything looks good everything's factory so far as far as the tune and everything so uh everything looks good in the radio it's on frequency like i said it does have a oh we're on the free counter so i don't have that plugged in but uh it's doing what a connex uh 4600 does 50 watts a 50 watt carrier with RF power all the way up out of the box so uh, you know no no issues from the factory that we can see other than the uh, the standard you know factory alignment which is not too great Put that in. And, um, well, it's got a few spikes those are way down there though um, but we're perfectionists so we'll uh, we'll get it uh, a little better so Anyway, we're going to pause this uh, video and we're going to do the uh, transmit alignment and we'll be back. We're back with the Connex 4600 for Paul. We lost electricity. We actually lost a transformer on the pole out there. So, uh, so um, now it's Friday and uh, we're finishing this radio up. We got the uh, transmit done on it. We got it cleared up. Looking good. That's, uh, we'll show you. That's a 70 megahertz span negative 20 db down and looking real good hello hello well i should change slugs but 2500 watt slug we're showing uh about a 50 watt key modulating about 210 215 so uh looking good so uh anyway um what we're going to do now is we're going to work on the receive on this radio and uh, do a receive test on it, sign ed test, and uh, we'll be back. All right, we're back and we're in uh, coming in there at uh, negative uh, at 12 dB sign ed at negative 94 amplitude. So we're going to do our uh, upgrading on the receive and we'll be back. Okay, and we're back and uh, we're actually reaching the uh, uh, same negative 12 that we were a while ago flickering in there at negative 12 let's we'll do it there no. 90, negative 99 so uh 6 db gain 6 db gain on this receive so uh really happy with that just goes to show you at the factory they don't optimize them now we do uh go in as you can hear we optimize for uh signal to noise ratio also because we don't want to pull up a bunch of static in the receive. We want to uh, lower your noise floor. So, um, let's see how low this baby will go. down to negative 120 still in there at negative 114 still here at negative 117 so we'll say negative 117 negative 118 so that's a very weak signal so all right well we're definitely happy with the way that came out so uh, we're going to get this radio back together and get a uh an overview of the radio so we'll be all right we're back with an overview of uh paul's 4600 so uh we've got everything hooked up here um hello let's uh listen to it first i got a little echo on so we can be cool hello radio one two three four five 
four three two one. Y'all like looking at the top of that radio with some knobs on it, don't you? Ah, bump. Hello, hello, one two. Audio check check. And it's kind of a glare, a little bit of a glare, I think, on it, but uh, I don't have my 500 watt slug. It's in my truck. Hello. Well, the glare's on the uh, needle there. It's modulating about 210 watts. Uh, we'll get a small slug in here so y'all can see uh, what it's dead can. Right at a four to one. Not 100 watt slug right at a 50 watt uh, key with the variable all the way up now if you roll this variable all the way down Paul I went ahead and I got you set at 2 watts I had to do some uh, some work on that to get that to work seeing it has the amplifier section without having to put a switch in it but I've got you hello 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 you don't do much on the meter there uh, yeah. 100 watt slug you're modulating right at 10 watts so uh, it's going from 2 to 10 watts uh, with it all the way down so uh, hello and it's clean like that too so uh, let's turn this all the way up and let's look at the uh, harmonics I'm going to show you that it is clean. Sometimes when you put the cases on these things, they go back to... So I'm opening this up to 70 megahertz. Negative 20 dB down. Throwing a 50 watt carrier. Hello. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, audio. And we're, of course, we're pegging that scale. It's only a 100 watt scale. Like I said, because it's... Mine's late in 200, but radio super clean and uh, it's super good receiver. Uh, Paul, I think you're going to be happy with it. You're set up to run a SR198, and uh, that's very important because to use that microphone because the radio is tuned for an SR198. It does make a difference. So uh, anyway, y'all be safe, be careful, and be kind. I've got a couple more of these Connexes. Uh, that are going to be up on the bench. Uh, we had a transformer failure out here in the shop. Second one in the last week. I guess the the storms uh, kind of tore everything up and just kind of left them halfway working. But uh, I was supposed to have had this one done yesterday, and I didn't. I'm just now getting it done. It's Friday evening. I still got two more to go. Uh, two more Connex 4600s. It's been that kind of week on Connex 4600s, and uh, so we'll be posting that. Uh, 4600s i'll be burning the midnight oil on that but uh, i've got to get this one over to ups and uh y'all be safe be careful and be kind the shop's back up running i'm not going to say i'm 100 percent i've still got a lot to do my ba my bench is in disarray it's nowhere like it was i'm still struggling to find things um so it's not quite business as normal yet but it's getting there and uh you know like i say uh we're doing the best we can so uh if you're waiting on something, uh, be patient. If you're waiting on a special order like an amp or a power supply, be patient. Be patient, please. I know you guys are being patient. I appreciate it. I've got the best. I've got the best customers on the planet. So, uh, you know, it's like I say, I only work for certain people, and uh, you know, I've got uh, some of the best customers on the planet. And I appreciate you guys. I'm gonna get out of here. Y'all be safe. Be careful. Be kind. Uh, like I say, got a couple more Connex 4600s coming up. Got some amplifiers coming up, big amplifiers, big, 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 big power supplies. Uh, Y'all stay tuned. We'll be back.